terrific. So now I was trying to make a video and keep it cordial on how we need to just, you know, be cautious with this coronavirus and, you know, keep our boat ramps open, be able to go out jet skiing and stuff. Now everybody pissed me off. Now we got to talk in, in, a, in a notion that you can understand. Not my followers on Sebastian Blucher. I'm talking about all the idiots in spring break, all the people that had to ruin it for everybody, all the people that make the governor just cause a shutdown. So let's do it this way. Let's define an asshole. Who is an asshole? Who's the one that fucked it up for everybody? Let's make this video right now and give you an idea of why we're going through this and what they could have done different instead of being a fucking asshole. This week, a seemingly ununited response in these United States. All the lights are coming on. As the COVID-19 pandemic continues its assault. If I get corona, I get corona. A typical asshole. At the end of the day, I'm not going to let it stop me from partying. And it hasn't stopped him from getting decked in his shit under his left eye. Like it's really messing up with my spring break. And this chick's been on spring break since she turned 18. What is there to do here other than go to the bars or the beach and they're closing all of it? It's really messing up. I think they're blowing it way out of proportion. Yeah, way out of proportion because people just died for no reason with this COVID and you want to go out there and get some more men. You're doing us bad. We need a refund. This virus ain't that serious. It's, serious. it's more serious things out there like hunger and poverty. And we need to address that. Apparently, this guy has been reading tabloids from 1987 and has no idea what's going on in 2020. We're just hanging out with them and trying to get drunk before everything closes. Before everything closes. Unfortunately, her mouth is always open. Thank your fellow boaters who said, I'm not going to listen to what they told me. I'm going to do what I want. And now I can't go in the water by myself. The message has to be clear to people who are coming uh, anywhere, but namely to our cities right now. You, you can't do that anymore. You know, the party is over. See, they already shut down the FWC, or I call them Wild Kingdom, already shut down the sandbar and the islands amid Florida's executive order. Why? Several complaints about crowd sizes on boats, the sandbar, and the islands because there was too many friggin' people out there just piled up. And now I can't go to the sandbar. Would you like to go in the river? Then follow directions. Very simple. So let's talk about this for a second. Vero Beach keeping parks and boat ramps open for now, urging social distancing against COVID-19. This is not what I'm saying. This is something that, you know, I mean, you can ask Almondo and them. They're, the boat ramps are shut down in the south, okay? Uh, you, you know, Vero Beach and Sebastian, they're still open. So what do we need to do? We need to just listen, okay? We were at the boat ramps. There are sheriffs that drive in once in a while and they check. All we have to do to keep our little ramps open and to keep our, you know, waterways open so we can go have fun is social distancing. Okay, let's look at another one. Sebastian Daly. Here's where we're at. Sebastian Blue Crew, right? City of Sebastian asks for social distancing or parks, boat ramps will close. This is the words right here. They will do it. Don't think that this fucking guy ain't going to do it. He's going to do it. Okay, they'll close the boat ramps. I want to go jet skiing. You want to go jet skiing. We need to ride. So all I'm asking everybody who's watching this video or your friends just get out there, put your boat in the water. We'll congregate somewhere else out in the water where we're not touching each other. We're not, you know, six feet, whatever. Let's not ruin this for everybody. And as I'm editing this video, here comes the breaking news. As of Wednesday, Florida governor issues stay-at-home order after weeks of resistance. Why? Because of the rapidly spreading disease, particularly as beachgoers and students on spring break continued to gather in large groups. Again, idiots who wanted to go out there and congregate and hug all over each other just caused me more grief 
and you all because now we have to stay at home. Is jet skiing an essential? No, it's not. How about going out fishing? Nope, throw it in the garbage. That's right. Unless you're an essential employee, your ass is staying home. You can thank all the beachgoers and students on spring break who decide to come down to different places and different parts of the state and just tell everybody to kiss their ass, I guess. Uh, that's good. No wake zone. What do you think of it? This thing, it's got a, it's got a power band that'll. Knock I saw you whipping donuts, man. Dude, this will, this will do it. It'll knock your dick in the dirt. <laughs> this is a machine. <laughs> Not bad for a little 720, huh? Holy shit! It's a little faster than mine right now, that's for sure. So what's the story here? Story is for all those in the Sebastian Blue Crew and the, and the Facebook page and all that. I have no idea when we're going riding because these spring breakers and people that couldn't follow directions fucked it up for all of us. So, you can thank all them, and, and maybe we get a time to ride, I don't know, I don't even know if the place is going to be open Saturday. I guess I'll be riding my jet ski in the driveway, because somebody couldn't follow directions. Until then, thanks for watching, and maybe I'll just decide to start taking this time to make videos on building the skis, because Lord knows, we can't go out and ride them. Have a good day.